Okay, Splat Pat, welcome back, man. You know I'm tired from my trip, doing my thing, but I'm going to put that up later. But <clears throat> what we have here is Kanye. Black people are wondering, I mean, you're so conflicted. A lot of people, I don't like him, I like him. He say this, he say that. But when you get a man time to get away from the media control speech and hear what he has to say and then give him the floor, you make your decision. But I got some clips here. He talked about everything. He talked about how they stopped putting Jay-Z up on game on, on how to make money. And people was like, man, you actually going to, Jay-Z, you going to tell people that? You, you going to tell your people how to make money? And Kanye is talking about, man, why not empower our people just like your community did? So is he anti-Semitic or is he just trying to look out for his own? Let's see what he say. I'm going to go into a couple of clips here and I'm going to let you people decide instead of the media. Let you decide. Here we go with a couple of them. The Jewish community, especially in the music industry, they'll take, in the entertainment period, they'll take one of us, the brightest of us, right, that can really feed a whole village, and they'll take us and milk us till we die, and then Stevie Wonder's son got to get a job, mm. right? Okay, well, he said that now. Let's go to another one, what he said, because I want y'all to interact on this. Dove is from American Apparel. Okay. But... I'm talking about put out my White Lives Matter tea. The White Lives mm -hmm. Matter tea don't say nothing. It don't say DEF CON or nothing on it, right? Mm -hmm. I'm like, put it out. And he's telling me, like, yo, I want you to visit the Holocaust Museum. And I was like, yo, I want you to visit Planned Parenthood. That's our Holocaust Museum. Mm -hmm. I'm like, it's a little turmoil. So what? So let me get back at y'all on this. So you see what he's saying? He, he's coming with a point of view. <clears throat> I want to go with this next one right here. Because, like I said, the whole interview, you can see it, Nori the Drink Champs, part three. I mean, it's a long clip, but I want y'all to just look in it and listen. Here's another one right here. I want y'all to really get into this and let me know what y'all think. It's by the fireplace to honor their grandmother. It's Jewish Zionists that's about that life, that's telling this Christian woman that has four black children to put that out as a message in the media. So when I drive by and I see the Hulu ads and i say the jp chase morgan ads i'm gonna let y'all know right now the devil is a defeated foe you can't poison me and by the way y'all don't already fuck with me so much y'all already black mirrored me you already made everybody think i'm crazy you already took my family away you already separated all my friends i don't got no celebrity friends because when i was on tv on instagram saying i don't know where my child is so he really gets into that. I want y'all to really like look at this. And like I said, he just he just speaking. The man is saying, I'm free. And he talks about how other people are not. Let's go into this right here. Here's another one. And we could discuss this at the end because I want y'all to really hear some of this. Cause they, I mean they really got into it. Here we go, another one. No, I want I want y'all to come kill me. No. I want you to smack me. No. I want you to do all the shit you, you rap about. No. All, hold on, no, all the shit you rap about. I want all the shit you rap about. I want you to come do it now. Come down to this joint right okay. now. Please. Please. Or otherwise, shut the fuck up unless you was there when the Kardashians kidnapped my kids. Okay, so now he's getting on some real points. And like I said, you know, he, he's bringing up everything. But like I said, he unhinged. I mean, he's he not unhinged. He's not unhinged. Let's clear it up. He just, like, say, tell him what it is. He's he saying, hey, I'm a billionaire. They didn't want to let y'all know that. They just say I'm crazy, this and that. And then listen to this last clip, and then we'll go into another discussion. It's actually that you're preparing to right. protect yourself. Mm. Because that's what I did. Because if they're, once they cancel four SoFi stadiums because of what's classified as wrong think, right. because you have group think, right. it is very important to have the black vote be in group think and to not separate from the thought and being completely in line with the agenda of the left, the Jewish media, and the Chinese. Okay. Okay. That is Black Pack breaking news. The Drink Champs 3, he talked about Drake. He talked about some funny stuff. But he also talked about investing in the community and saying, why can't we have information that gets transferred into intelligence for us? You know, he talks about, I mean, about the Chase thing. All this money I brought and that Chase canceled me. Like you say, you either the victim or you the bully. But I want y'all to go into it. Uh, he talks about Black Lives Matter, how in all those areas that are George Floyd, now crime is up through the roof. But just give him a chance, look at it. And if you feel he anti-Semitic, isn't that? Well, then you made your decision. 
But like I say, is he a common? Uh, he a common day folk hero? Let's see. And like I said, let's see what we can see.